The Bureau of Alcohol, Tobacco and Firearms has seized several hundred pounds of explosives at a Spokane Valley restaurant. Yesterday, undercover agents found more than 5,000 ping pong ball bombs in Peter Westhaver's van parked outside of Hooters in the Spokane Valley. KXY4's Jim Humphrey has a story that you saw first here on KXY4 and shows us why the bombs would not really be suitable for terrorism. Well, like the name implies, these heavy-duty firecrackers are really not much bigger than a ping-pong ball. You could certainly blow off your hand with one. You could scare a lot of people in a crowd, but they're not really anti-personnel devices. What is of concern is the sheer volume of the explosives found here. ATF agents say inside the suspect's truck, they found 18 of these five-gallon Home Depot buckets, and inside each bucket, they found 300 of those ping-pong ball bombs. This investigation got to start back on May 25th when the suspect, Peter Westhaver, started shopping around some samples of his product. Two of them fell into the hands of a cooperative source who went to the feds. On Thursday, Westhaver came to Hooters and met with an undercover agent inside. A deal was apparently struck, and when Westhaver came back outside, he was arrested and gave consent for a search of his vehicle. That's when agents found all of those Home Depot buckets. Tonight, he's being held on the charge of selling explosives without a license. Reporting in Spokane Valley, Jeff Humphrey, KXLY4.